Lethality Scion. As promised a long time ago, um, you guys asked for Lethality Scion a long, long time ago, Lethality Scion Jungle, and I didn't really get to play it for a long time because, uh, well, we had better things to record. Uh, but now, finally, we will be able to play a Lethality Scion game in the jungle. When it comes to the rune page, we can go between Sorcery and Domination, I guess. Um, so we could go Dark Harvest or Electro or Face Rush. I am thinking I'll go Electro because I want to one-shot them. Then I also go Cheap Shot. I will go for Eyeball Collection. I will go for Endless Hunter so I can run around the jungle a little bit faster. Uh, then let's get Water Walking and... Maybe Celerity, honestly. Maybe we have a lot of mind speed or Nimbus Cloak. Yeah, Nimbus Cloak sounds good. Attack speed, just because you need it to farm the jungle slightly easier. I think the gems are quite annoying for us, but I mean, we'll see how it goes, right? Uh, so this is my preferred Scion rune page um, when it comes to jungle. Of course, again, Scion jungle is probably not a very strong and powerful champion, but uh, if you want to play a game and you want to have fun, sure. Besides that, I'm kind of bold today because I want to hairdresser and uh, unfortunately... Um, they had cut my hair. Well, actually, fortunately, but um, it doesn't really look very, very, very good on camera so far. But tomorrow I'm gonna style it a little bit better, so it will look uh, slightly better. Today, I, today I didn't really plan on streaming nor um, or not streaming nor uh, recording. But uh, so be it, right? So be it. It's not about looks; it's about the gameplay. Anyway, we are heading into the game right now. Yeah, because you want me to say it? <laughs> I will say it. You're literally better than fake. <laughs> so I just subscribed to me, but I'm all offline. What the fuck? Wait, what? I'm not offline. I'm recording. Oh my god! I'm supposed to record. I'm streaming. Why am I streaming? Ah! Oh, I got guys. I have to. I have to leave. I have to leave. Wait, wait. What do I do now? No, it's so doomed. Oh, I was supposed to record. Okay, I have to leave. I have to leave. I, I will continue recording uh, off stream. I'm sorry, guys. Okay, I'm not streaming today. I'm not streaming today. Sorry. Bye, bye. Fuck! Well, we are in game now, and um, like I mentioned, I think the first part of the video was uh, happened on stream, uh, so the first two minutes, and now um, this part of the video can happen um, <laughs> just recording. <laughs> I know how this happened, I don't know how I press streaming and not recording, I really, really misclick. We can charge our queue a little bit before the... So, uh, you should charge your queue a little bit before the buff spawns, but you should make sure that you actually hit the buff and not miss it. Because your first queue is very, very important. I think playing phase rush on Cyan Jungle is also very viable, just so we are on the same page. Make sure that the W explodes, uh, with, uh, explodes with the damage here. The clear in the Cyan Jungle is not bad at all. Okay, never do that! Never push them out of the leash range. You have to push them to the wall or push them elsewhere. The jungle is getting changed anyway, and a lot of uh, new junglers um, will be maybe more doable because of the smite change, so... Oh my goodness! Okay, as you can see that my uh, silent jungle could uh, use some work. Hmm, I was hoping we could chase him then. Okay, that's perfect. You know why? Because even though he died, there's a wave for us. There's a wave stacking to our tower. Okay, it's not um, that big of a wave, but it's like a little bit of a wave. Honestly, I'm pretty surprised how well uh, Cyan passive stacks in the jungle. I'm almost at... Uh, look at the amount of health I get already. Even though you are Lethality Scion, you get so much HP. I think the Cyan passive should get nerfed, I don't know. So this is the, like, the really bad thing about Scion is that... You can't really gank well. Like, your ganks are useless. Planned, of course. These poor guys. The good thing is that it seems like I'm getting a kill here. I have 2000 gold, so, uh, you know, it's about time, right? See, the archers are not bad, and then a, a lot of long swords. We are gonna go first item, Prowler's Claw. See, the archers are a bit tricky, though, because again, I'm hoping that the enemy team is like a bunch of inters, right? But as you can see, uh, as well, I'm at, uh, currently I'm at 320 bonus HP, which is really, really nice, considering that I don't build any HP. Yeah, don't let the shield decay, never ever. Never ever let the shield drop, you need to do damage with the shield. You need to do damage with the shield. Here would be perfect, we can damage two of them. 
Because at this point we are strong enough to farm two camps at the same time. how it works you come in the brushes and then you get solo balls I'm fine ah no but I can kill with the passive Okay, see, so this is the situation in which Phase Rush is way more broken than Electrocute because... Okay, so, without Electro, let's be honest, I would never kill Uder there. I would actually never kill Uder there without Electro, but with Phase Rush, I'll probably kill Zeraf. But Zeraf died anyway to Diana, so it's fine. One third of my health is uh, the passive, so it's going pretty well so far. Um, they are not really building armor yet, so they are still kind of dying to our damage. As soon as I get Prowler's Claw, um, I can also Prowler's Claw on them when they die. Or I can Prowler's Claw on them instantly and then try to chase them. But my biggest strength is still when they face check, right? This is when Sion uh, really excels uh, when they face check. The only problem is, honestly guys, honestly, the only problem is Sion. I don't actually know what to build. I mean, I know we have a Sion one trick in high lore, right? The boss plays one trick. But uh, he plays only the Sion. But like, I don't actually know what he builds. I don't really, I never really looked at it. I know he like... Does different items, I guess. Sometimes he does like Prowless, sometimes he does something else. But for like pure damage, you know, after Prowless, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I will have to figure it out. Ooh, I might be killing myself. I'm not gonna. It's honestly. Honestly, it's not bad, you know. <laughs> it's not bad that I missed. Because if I would not miss, I think I would actually die. It's literally sign gameplay. You just go somewhere and you like wait and you hope that someone's gonna run right into you. It's not bad, you know. I'm the same, lab same um, level as Uder. And, well, I mean, maybe I also got ourselves a Drake. Of course, hell would be so much better. But keep in mind, when you guys play solo queue, overall, like when you play solo queue, don't ever trade Drake for Herald. Herald in the early game. Okay, I'm talking most, mostly about plates, right? If you can get Herald and you can get plates for it, it's always gonna be so much better than Drake. <laughs> no, Diana, you kill Stealer! You're so useless! How dare you! No! I almost stole it as well! I had to steal it. I, I mean, I wanted to secure the kill, of course, not to steal anything. Okay, I'm not sure what this Nami is doing. Uh, but she just kind of killed it. So. I'm getting some kills on Diana here. Here and there, I guess. I'm not sure if I can... Well, I burned the flash. I think that's a bit too deep. I'll just go and push mid if Diana doesn't. Or the Kiana, sorry. Why am I saying Diana? I always have this thing, you know, that I uh, say the wrong name all the time. I think of Kiana, but I say Diana. Or I see Kiana, and I still say Diana. As you can see, guys. We don't really mind. <laughs> we don't really mind our mid laner doing bot lane stuff. I can just take his farm myself. I have almost 1000 HP bonus from my passive. How broken is it? How can I go full lethality and self 2000 HP? It's so OP. Wait, okay, the Kiana Plus was giga panic. She's also stealing every kill, by the way. Well, at least I have. Um, I stole some of her minions, at least. But yeah, I mean, when it comes to farming and all. This champ is never gonna be bad jungle or lane. I do think still that like the most useful sign is the tank Sion on the top side. You know, the, the Sion that like when he comes into the team fight, he has like 3000 HP at like minute 15 and there is no one that can actually kill him. I, I like that Sion the most, but um, playing the Tality Sion is very fun. Or like, I I think the Tality Sion is the most fun to watch and to play probably, but the Tality Sion is not easy to play because you actually have to use your brain a little bit. 
And I also don't think Lethality Scion is going to be useful in every game, right? Because there will be games where you are playing Lethality Scion and you are going to be useless because, let's say, enemies are not going to face you. Even in this game, they have a lot of... Uh, I mean, they are relatively squishy. So if I ever catch them, they are going to die, of course, right? Like, you know, Zerav and Kogma and blah, blah. But there's also a world where um, they, uh, well, don't face check me and they are going to kite me easily, right, with the champions at the same time, so... Maybe this, like this, for sure, not good. Okay. This is not looking great. Gonna flash out here. Wait, what? Really? The passive killed me? Nami! Come here, Nami! No! Where's my face rush? Where's my Prowler's Claw? <laughs> I didn't have face rush, no Prowler's Claw. Okay, now I have your Okay, that, that was like very in. That was very Like, let's be like... But this... Okay, so, just so we're on the same page, engages like that will never work, okay? Just so we're on the same page. If you go in like that, this will never work. No matter what, this will never work. Because they see you coming from up front, from very far away, uh, and all they have to do, literally, is just... Um, well, juke your ult, and then they will kill you. Uh, when you play Lethality Scion, what you want is that uh, when people run into you, then you are gonna be strong, then you are gonna easily kill them. But if you are the one running into the people, that's not the same. Electro, how much damage did they do? 500? Maybe Phaedra just straight up better. Oh no! They just rushed Nash! They didn't go to Drake, they just rushed Nash! But it's fine. Well, we didn't have people to answer them there, so uh, we died. And also, I do think that we are getting pretty heavily outscaled in this game, so... As the game progresses, we are not gonna have more fun. Um, yeah, no one does really. Okay, okay, okay. You know what? In hindsight, um, I think uh, Face Rush is better. <laughs> <laughs> and that's because I think it's like too easy for them to kite you. And also, if I actually have phasers there and Tinoid tries to chase me like that, I would most likely end up alive because, uh, you know, I can just run. And I feel like the electrocute is only, only good, um, really, in few cases where you, um, well, in very, very few cases where you can actually one shot someone. I would really love to fight a Zera when he face checks me, but. Hook him! <laughs> ah! Nice! We got him! We got him! We got him! We got him! It's actually worth because he was worth a shutdown and he also used uh, summoners. So it's actually giga giga worth, I think. That was... That was very... Um, hopeful, I would say. I mean, at this point, they, uh, I think our draft is just shit, you know? At this point, it doesn't really matter if I'm playing Sion or any other champion. At this point, our draft is just kind of bad. So, um, we are just getting outdrafted a little bit. They are gonna kite us and we can't do anything about it. Wait, what? How fast is she? How fast is she? I'm coming. Wait, what? Wait, what? Did our trash solo kill Zera? But how is support role even remotely balanced? This guy's gonna die. Oh, I'm dead. And he's gonna get out because he can go over the wall. Okay, so at this point, I would say probably I should go Last Whisper, right? I mean, this is probably the, like the point where you want Last Whisper. The thing is, I have so much damage, but how hard it is to get close to them. And that's always always the problem with Sion. Again, it's much easier when they go into you. I think Sion teamfights is just not as powerful when you go Lethality. It's much different if I'm a frontline Sion. The good thing is that even though I'm Lethality Sion, I still have 3,300 HP because Riot thinks it's balanced up a passive that gives you 1.5 almost K HP um, at this point. So that's nice from Riot Games, making sure that, uh, you know, they, 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 got, they, they help us out. Is this something I should ult for, or is it something I should not ult for? 
question right here. Why is everyone running from me? Where is my face rush? I need my face rush. Why do I feel so useless without face rush? Everyone just runs. No one cares. You know, I'm supposed to be like the really, really broken champion that everyone dies to. But instead, when they see me, they just run. And I'm running after them and I'm so useless. I don't know, maybe I just ult wrong. Or maybe I should always save my prowless claw or something. I, I don't actually know. All I know is that uh, I'm dead. That's, that's all I know. If I ever hit ult or Q like a fool, Charge Q or ult on someone. Oh my goodness, they are so good that like oh I'm five and six now. The early game was so perfect. I was four and one. Now I'm five and six. I got one kill. Are we winning this or losing? Uh, I think Kogma is kind of killing everyone, so probably we are losing. <laughs> okay, 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 bad idea, bad idea. But they didn't start it, okay? I didn't have vision, so it was a flip. It was a flip. I just flipped it. I just flipped it a little bit and I hope that. Uh, oof! So much damage. She can W here soonish. Ooh, she must be. She misplayed, she misplayed. I feel like you being a Kiana right now is so much more fun than being at goddamn uh, Sion because, well, I just can't get close. I mean, my ult, fully charged, 1.4k damage. I mean, that's like just crazy, right? Like, the damage is actually just crazy. And uh, I guess this is also kind of crazy, so... Doesn't it look like they are winning this game, no? I mean, I feel like they should be winning this game, but I don't know, they are just in... Okay, I have to smite, I have to smite for HP. Okay, I have uh, 1.5 thousand HP now from my passive, and we are dead. For sure. No way. Boom. Um, I am. Wait, how does this guy do so much damage? I don't understand. He's a tank. I thought Trash is supposed to be a tank. So why is he doing so much damage? Uh, what the. No, I should have ulted instantly. Maybe. Ah, oh, my pro is close to to too close range. I think they might be the game, honestly. <laughs> the six item Kogmo. I could have killed him by flash eat instead of flash ulting. If I actually flash eat there, I'm pretty sure he dies instantly. Ah, that's such a misplay from me. You know, he was actually dead there. He could not survive that. The most dead Kogmo I've ever seen in life, probably. There was no deader Kogmo. That Kogmo was the deadest. Well, I guess maybe he's still the deadest because the Darius is kind of killing everyone now. <laughs> he's, he's not even... He's not even gonna die. <laughs> like, how stupid is that gem? He's not even gonna die. And I feel he's FK for some reason. I think he's done with the game. He got sniped from like 3000 range from Zerabul. He got one shot and he's like, yeah, guys, kind of done with the game here. Don't want to play anymore. I mean, like, really? <laughs> like, really? Dude, like, how did he get there? He's a Zeraph. How did he get there? Oh, no. Oh, no. I'm just dead, right? Well, that ult could have been used, like, you know, before I died or so. Before I died or something. Uh, or something. That's a lot of um, interesting plays here. Oh. That bubble uh, almost saved the day. If not the fact that, uh, well, we had more follow than just one person, I guess. Oh my god. How is he even play? When Darius gets a reset, right? When he gets a reset and he gets his passive, and all he had to do is just like run, like press st strike breaker and Q and ooh, ah, just... Anyway, um, I don't even know how to build, honestly guys, I, I don't know. Like GA could maybe be good, no, GA is not good, right? But I could build something like uh, the, the um, Serpent's Fang, if they had shields, which they don't. So what do I actually build? Should I build like the anti-healing item? I could build the Chainsword. The only problem with this is that they could try to steal with the Zerah. 
Oh, it's over. That's the gate. Wait. Mm, is it now? We don't really have where to push. I don't think really we can end, you know? We don't have waves. At this point, though, we are just getting cold. This buff is not gonna do anything for us. I mean, I guess it's, it's nice to have it, you know? It's better, play, it's better play better to have it than not to have it, but still. Almost 2k HP! This game's so long! Mm. I think I have to hold out here. Plan with ulting us that we cannot ult them. Oh, I messed up though. Well, I did. I couldn't really kill him though. Yeah, that was Samus. At this point, the Kogma was just too strong. It was a nice game though. It was a nice game. I mean, we lost this game, but it was a kind of a kind of banger, honestly. I mean, we and we, we did end up losing, right? But I mean, at, at this point of the game, let's be honest, Zerav and Kogma should probably win this game. Even Tindamer, they just have like superior champions. Um, and there is a way of playing Scion Jungle, like Lethality Scion Jungle. It is very difficult, right? Because again. It can happen that they are very useless at, at cases where um, you can't get close. Uh, split push is slightly better then, then probably you wanna play um, elsewhere and not uh, on the in the jungle. Uh, you wanna play on the top line, right? You wanna play on the side lane. So I think in these cases it's probably way easier if you actually um, play it elsewhere. But yeah, our damage, we couldn't really do that much, right? We don't have any poke, 28,000, 29,000 damage. Um, damage taken, uh, not a, a lot as well. Uh, well, more than anyone else in the game, but still not that much. Uh, but yeah, thank you very much for watching. And again, please make sure to tell me what kind of champion you like to see uh, being played on my channel. I will make sure to record that video. We have the Lethality Sion. Uh, maybe there's something else that you really want to see. So, thank you very much for watching. And see you in the next video. Bye-bye.